là một số vấn đề quan trọng khác. Hello teacher. Wait a minute, Laura. Wait for me. Teacher is still opening our lesson, okay? Okay. Okay, wait, because my internet is still connecting. Wait for me. Okay, I think it's okay now. All right, good evening, Laura. Good evening, teacher. How was your school today? Mm, I'm going to sleep. What did you learn today in school? English. English. Okay, and then what else? And math. And math. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, um, how about the activities that you do today? What are the things that you do? Uh, um... I don't know. You don't know? All right. Okay, so how about the weather tonight, Laura? Is it okay? No, it's raining. Oh, it's raining. Oh. You, you remember our lesson last, last, last time? The rain is very hard. You remember it? Yes. Yeah. It's very noisy and then the internet is not good. Even in the Philippines, when it's raining, the internet is not good. Okay, so let's begin our lesson tonight, Laura. Let's begin. Okay, so our lesson for tonight is Can you read the title? A trip to the city. Okay, a trip to the city. So what is a city, Laura? Um city is um It's a big city. Uh -huh. And we have everyone. Oh, so what can you see in the city? Um house. House and then um school. Uh -huh. Um a market. A market, a school, what else? Um, a cinema. A cinema. Um, a shop. Mm -hmm. A food. Um, Uh, and then, which place in the city is your favorite, Laura? Um, it's many. Uh, give me two examples. Hmm. Um, a cinema. Cinema and is your favorite. Yes. Mm -hmm. And 
School. 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 So your favorite place in the city is a cinema and the school. Why? Yeah. The cinema I can watch every every everything in the school I can learn, I can play with friends. Uh -huh. So in the cinema you can watch a film and in the school you can talk and play with your friends. Yes. Very good. How about the market? You don't like a market? Yes, I like. Are oh, you like to? Because why? Because in the market I can buy. You can buy what? What? What's your favorite thing to buy? Mm -hmm. Food. Food. Okay. Me too. I like going to the market because I can buy my snacks. And then some grocery items that we can store in our house. Okay, so let's begin. All right, what number is this, Laura? 100. Okay, 100. Or 100, okay? Very good. When there are two zeros, that is a hundred. Okay, Laura? Yes. Okay, again. Okay, again, when there are two zeros, what's what's that number? 100. All right, very good. Next one. What's this number? 1,000. 1,000, very good. So when there are three zeros, what, what is that number? It's 1,000. Very, very good. It's thousands okay now let's have this one what's good and what's not good um ah, here what can you say about the picture laura um a farm what's that a farm a farm Okay, are you sure is that the farm? I don't know. <laughs> so I can't see. Uh, what do you think is that? There are some houses. Okay, and then? Um, hmm. Oh. I don't know. So there are houses. So what, what do you think is that place? But that's not a farm, okay? But what do you think is that place? Mm. Mm. Those are houses. And then? Mm. Where's that? I don't know. Uh -huh. uh, here. How many homes are there in a village, Laura? What do you think? I can see four homes in the village. Yes. There are four <laughs> homes in the picture. So that place, you call that a village, okay? Okay. So how about you, Laura? Do you live in a village? No. Oh, where do you live? In a city? A town? Um, a town. Oh, you live in a town. Very good. So now, how many houses and flats are there in a city? What do you think, Laura? How um, much have and that is many? Mm -hmm. There are many houses and flats in a city, right? So which yes. one is which one is mm, more more houses that you can see in a village or in a city? Um, in the city. Mm -hmm. In the city 
Okay, now, yeah. Laura, what's good about living in a village? What do you think? Um, mm, what's good about living in a village? Is uh, Hmm. Hmm. Oh, what's good? Living in a village. Okay, we'll find it out when we continue our lesson. Okay. So now, Laura, what is this? What place is this? A bus stop. A bus stop. Now, what can you do in a bus stop? You can... Um, you can. Mm -hmm. You can what? Run everywhere. Mm, and then, what can we see in the bus stop? Um, I can see bus. Yes. So we in the bus stop we can see buses, and then in the bus stop we can ride. A bus in that place. So next one, Laura, what's on the picture? Um, a supermarket. <coughs> supermarket. Okay, supermarket or? Um. Hmm. Supermarket or? What's that? Mm. Mm, what's that? Shop country. Yes, a shopping center. So in in your um in your place, Laura, do you have a shopping center near your house? Yes. Wow. Do you walk? Do you walk going to the shopping center or do you drive a car? Drive. Drive. Ah, oh, you still need to ride a car. So what can we see? Or what can we do inside the shopping center, Laura? You can buy a suit, a t-shirt, a bag. Many. All right. So in the shopping center, you can see here, uh, you can buy all the things that you needed in this place because it's complete. All that you need, you can see it here. Okay, next one. What's this? Mm, city. Yes, that is a city. Very good. So what is in the city or what can you see there? A uh, many pay. Yes. So in the city, mostly we see there tall buildings, right? Mm, yes. There are tall buildings in the city. Uh, most of it are office, schools, and some establishments. Okay, next one. What's this, Laura? A farm. A farm. Very good. Oh, that is a village. So a village is near a farm. Okay. So what do you think is a village? Um, how? Um, A cow. Uh -huh. well, how about the houses? Can you tell me about the houses in the village? Um, house in the village. 
Uh -huh. So in a village, there are only few houses, but there is a big space for planting. Or you can also have a farm near your house. Because in a village, there are only few houses. Unlike in the city, there's no enough space to have a farm. Because all this place, you can see tall buildings and establishments, okay? Okay. So now, let's have this one, Laura. Write sentences about a village and a city. Okay, or you just tell me the answer. So example, in a village, not many people live here. So in the city, what um, do you think? Many people live in city. Very good. There are many people that lives in a city. Okay, so now, Laura, can you read the sentence here? Thousands of people live here. Home or afternoon. Most garden are bigger. People often walk more weekly. Trees are often longer here. It's quiet here. Some um, are near here. Road of often doctor. There are pig shopping centers. centers. Okay. People often walk more slowly. Home are often oh, it's noisy here. Not many people have garden. Sometimes there are shopping here. School have lots of classroom. All right. So these are some differences between a village and a city. So in a village, there are men, there are a few people who lives here only. And like in the city, thousands of people live here. So in the village, the gardens are bigger. While in the city, sometimes it has no garden. And then in the village, uh, the streets are very long. And it's quiet. Unlike in the city, it's very noisy. All right. And then in a village, there's no shopping center. And then the schools are old and only small. Unlike in the city, the school is big. All right. So now let's have this activity, uh, this, this vocabulary word. So what do you call him? this one in the picture, Laura? A row. Mm -hmm. A road. Very good. Next one. Mm. Mm. Oh, what's that? Hmm. Uh, so the first picture is a road. How about the second picture? You can see here stop lights or traffic lights. Hmm. And then tall buildings. Oh, what's that? Uh, it starts with letter S. S. Yes. Hmm. Hmm. S. S. What? You can say it. That's correct. With. What? What's that? Mm. Say it one more time. With. Street. <laughs> Okay, so the answer is a street. Oh, now, Laura, what's the difference between a road and a street? Um, uh, with... Mm, 
The sweet is passed in city and the rose is in the village. Okay. So a road you can see the you can see it where? The city. Oh, in a city. How about in the street? With TT CT two. Okay, so these are this is the difference with the, uh, this is the difference between a road and a street. Okay, can you say it, Laura? Don't always have roading in them. Mm -hmm. While on the street. With a do. Yes. So in a road, mostly you can see that in highways. Do you know what is a highway? Yes. All right. So a road, mostly you can see that, that in highway or in a big, big place like in a city. While in the street, you can see lots of traffic lights. Okay. Okay. All right. Now, let's have this one, Laura. What did Daisy do last week? Listen and draw a line from the date to the correct picture. Okay, now Laura, you listen to the audio file and then draw a line on the correct answer, okay? Okay. Let's begin. 22B, a trip to the city. Look at the pictures. What did Daisy do last week? Listen and look. There is one example. Hello, Daisy. Did you go to the city last week? Yes, Uncle Tony. Sunday is great. Was that your first day there? Yes. Wait a minute, Laura, because my daughter is very naughty. Okay, let's continue. Dad. 22B. A trip to the city. Look at the pictures. What did Daisy do last week? Listen and look. There is one example. Hello, Daisy. Did you go to the city last week? Yes, Uncle Tony. Sunday was great. Was that your first day there? Yes. Dad bought our tickets. Then we got on the train. You can travel to the city really quickly. I know. Can you see the line from the word Sunday? On Sunday, Daisy went on the train. Now you listen and draw lines. One. What did you do on Tuesday? The weather here was very sunny that day. On Tuesday, we went for a boat ride on the river. Wow! Our seats were at the front by a screen that told us about important places. I wore my best clothes that day. Two. And Monday was good too. Did you go shopping that day? Mum wanted to be quiet that day. We went for a quick walk round a lake. I like doing things like that. Me too. And we had a picnic there. Three. What about on Saturday? I think we went shopping that day. Yes, that's right. Did you buy anything? Well, we got some food and Mum and I looked at the clothes. Was that exciting? No. 
I think it's more exciting to be outside. Four. It rained a lot one day. We went to the cinema. Which day was that? Was it Wednesday? No, it was Friday. The screen was really big. And what was the film about? Some children who sailed to another country. Five. And tell me about Thursday. OK. On Thursday, we had lunch in a cafe. We sat and watched all the people and cars and buses. The street was really busy. What did you eat? I don't know, but it was nice. I loved being in the city. Okay, so are you finished what? answering? Uh, One more? No. Yes. Okay. 22B. A trip to the city. Look at the pictures. What did Daisy do last week? Listen and look. There is one example. Hello, Daisy. Did you go to the city last week? Yes, Uncle Tony. Sunday was great. Was that your first day there? Yes. Dad bought our tickets. Then we got on the train. You can travel to the city really quickly. I know. Can you see the line from the word Sunday? On Sunday, Daisy went on the train. Now you listen and draw lines. One. What did you do on Tuesday? The weather here was very sunny that day. On Tuesday, we went for a boat ride on the river. Wow! Our seats were at the front by a screen that told us about important places. I wore my best clothes that day. Two. And Monday was good too. Did you go shopping that day? Mum wanted to be quiet that day. We went for a quick walk round a lake. I like doing things like that. Me too. And we had a picnic there. Three. What about on Saturday? I think we went shopping that day. Yes, that's right. Did you buy anything? Well, we got some food and Mum and I looked at the clothes. Was that exciting? No. I think it's more exciting to be outside. Four. It rained a lot one day. We went to the cinema. Which day was that? Was it Wednesday? No, it was Friday. The screen was really big. And what was the film about? Some children who sailed to another country. Five. And tell me about Thursday. OK. On Thursday, we had lunch in a cafe. We sat and watched all the people and cars and buses. The street was really busy. What did you eat? I don't know, but it was nice. I loved being in the city. OK, now let us check, Laura. Are you finished? Um, One, two, three. Yes, it's five. It's five now. I think it's finished. Wait. Wait. Uh -huh. Um...
I'm finished. Okay, you're finished. So let's check the answers. So letter E is Tuesday, correct? Monday is A. Sunday. Oh, what's this? Sunday is D, correct? This one is Friday, correct? All right. And then letter F is Thursday. Very good, Laura. You got a perfect score. Okay, good job. Five points. Okay, next one, Laura. So these are the activities that Daisy had this week, okay? Monday, can you read it? Monday, Daisy went to the left. Okay, so now let's have this one. Questions, what's really quiet or what moves quickly? Okay, now which two letters do the words question, quiet, and quickly begin when you write them? What letter does question, quiet, and quickly begin? What letter? Um... Mm. Question. This is quickly. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What letter does it start? The words question, quiet, and quickly. What letter does, do they begin? What's that letter? Q. Very good. It starts with letter Q. Okay, now, what makes a loud, a loud noise when it moves in a city? What do you think is that, Laura? Mm. A loud noise when it moves in a city. Yes. No. Mm. Loud. Yes, loud. Loud noise when it's in the city, when it moves in the city. This. Okay. So what are these? A car. Very good. A car. So this one. Uh, these are the things that when it moves in a city, it's very noisy, okay? Can you read it, Laura? A plane, a train, a motorbike, a lorry, a bus, a car. Okay, so these are noisy mm, things when it moves in a city. Very good. Okay, now, what makes quieter noises in a city? Hmm. Mm. Mm. For example, it's still noisy, but it's not no as noisy as the cars. What what's that? It's still noisy, mm. but it's not as noisy as the car. Or a plane or a train, but it's still noisy. A plane? No. Oh, it's it's the most noisiest um thing in the city. Không bấm còi trong thành phố. Không bấm còi xe. Um. Uh, oh, give, give me an example. What? Bus stop. Oh. A bus stop that's not noisy. It has no sound. Ah, that has no sound. E. Oh, this is the answer. Can you read it? TV, radio, from people, wind. 
Okay. So the the most noisiest thing on the city is plane, train, motorbike, lorry, bus, and a car, right? And then the next thing that's uh, noisiest is TV, radio, phone, people, and the wind. Sometimes the horn of the motorcycle. Okay, now, Laura, what's really quiet? Um... Bus stop. Okay, all here. Snow, you read it. Snow. No. I computer bird make spider. All right, very good. Okay, now what moves really quickly in the city? Really, really quickly. Uh, okay, very good. Car is correct. Next one. Mom, what moves more slowly in a city? Uh, mm -hmm. More slowly. Mm -hmm. By walking. Um. Yes, that's correct. Bike and people walking. Now, which is quieter, a car or a computer? Please answer our question quickly and quietly. Uh, which is quieter, a car or, or a computer? A computer. Why? Because the car is um has a long then the computer can more volume but the guy the car not can small volume. Yes, correct. Because the computer has only a small volume or sound and like the car when it horns it's very loud okay next activity laura listen and look right yes or no okay can you read it first laura when we live in the city in saturday some people on lounge in dance room because they watching ben uncle ben's uncle is clown clown Clown. Oh, this one. Say this word again. Loud. Laughing. Loud. Laughing. Okay, very good. Okay. Oh, now this is an example. One of the boys is pointing at something. Answer is yes. Next one. You can only see one person on the motorbike. Answer is no. Okay, number one, Laura. Um. The Number one is yes. Oh, you read first. The clown is standing between two. Hmm. The clown is standing between two children. Yes or no? Yes. Yes. Number two. The bigger car in front. Of the small car. Yes. Oh, no, no. No. Okay, number three. A woman is waiting at the stop in the street. No. No. Next one. A girl is climbing up the tree to the hill. The black cat. Yes. Yes. Next one. There are more than two keyboards in the sub window. Hmm. Do you know what is a keyboard? No. 
Yes, Ay. no. That's correct, no. no. But what is a keyboard, Laura? Because the keyboard is um, oh. in the computer. Yes, that's correct. That is a part of a computer. You use that when you type. Okay, number six. The person with the guitar is wearing red chosen. No. No, because what color is that? A pink. Again, what is that color? What? What's that color of her trousers? A purple. Yes, it's purple, not pink. Very good. Okay, six points for you, Laura. Very good. Okay, next activity. Oh, wait a minute. It says here, color that car. Okay, now, Laura, you're going to color the car. Can you see the car, the small one that's in front of the bigger one? Yes. Okay, color that car red, please. Okay, you have to color that car red. I finished. Hmm, color the whole car. Oh. Color the color the whole car. Why? <laughs> okay, your next one. Now, find the man with a beard. What? Uh, can you see him? Find the man with the beard. Mm. Can you see him? Mm -hmm. Ah, yeah. I okay. see. Now, make it blue. Okay. Next one. There are two computers in the picture. Color the one that the boys are carrying. Can you see it? Yes. Color it yellow. Okay, and now color the coat. The one that is the man wearing. Oh, it means that it is wrong. Mm -hmm. Oh, you raised the color blue in the clown. And then you transfer it to the man with a beard. Mm -hmm. Oh, you raised that. You raised the you raised. The color blue. Erase the color blue. Oh. And then you transfer it here. Uh, transfer that here. The man with the beard. Okay. You transfer the color blue there. Oh. Uh, Yes, that's correct. Okay, now, color the coat, the one that the clown is wearing. Oh, what color do you like? Mm. Um, I have green, yellow, red, and blue. Okay, maybe you can color it green. Color the clown's coat green. Okay, very good, Laura. So you got all the correct answers. Four points for this activity. Very good. All right. So, Laura, we, have, we don't have enough time. Maybe we can 
continue this one on Wednesday. Okay. Bye. All right. Chuck Long on. Bye.